Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Webform. Today I am going to show you the next video tutorial of shopping cart project and in this project I am going to design uh, the home page. Uh, that uh, page will be uh, display when user first time open that website. So uh, that uh, uh, that page will be binded with the data grid and uh, that data grid will be bind with the database table product and uh, you can see that uh, here we have all columns and uh, also in the advanced tab we have some functionalities using SQL data source but uh, the advanced features will not display at it here uh, because that features will be available to the clients uh, to, uh, to the admin only so uh, after that you have to uh, edit templates uh, when the first time uh, user view that website that item template will be open and uh, you can see that we have a product image a product name product price product description company name and the product image so just i want to show that product image in the image control on the image control so just uh, you can drag a image control from the toolbox and just paste it under that item template and bind that image uh, with the image url property uh, with the field binding uh, that is the product image and the format is none uh, and after that you want to show the product name uh, as well as the product price so uh, just uh, you can see that product name label is uh, there and the product price is there okay so uh, just is a little bit uh, quite simple uh, think you can uh, you can add it in ASP.NET uh, ASP web form so uh, that is the uh, added template so in which we have only the uh, price is uh, the title of the product and the th 300 rupees is the product price so just add it product price and just I want to add a symbols just after that the product name sorry just after the product price so just you have to search the product price uh, in the rupees so uh, just use the number HTML that is that number you have to use it just google it and uh, you have to save this number and paste it here just after the price label so uh, the shopping cart project is the big project uh, in ASP.NET and uh, if you want to learn that project then you uh, have to design other uh, similar type of product project easily so actually uh, that project is hold a total number of uh, card operations as well so again you have to add web form with the master page and again you have to add a new data list for the detail page and in the detail item template you have to add another uh, image and uh, also bind that image with the database field image url as well as the price label and uh, product price product description uh, and uh, and all other things will be uh, added uh, just after that image so the detailed description will show by the or you can say uh, see by the view, uh, viewers So that uh, the product description and uh, the product title, product description and the product price so that 
product price, price label. Okay, and uh, company informations and the product description. Actually, company information is not uh, actually uh, needed at here. So you can uh, bind your image just after that. Okay. Now, uh, in the description page, you have to take a uh, uh, quantity also. So in the company name, actually at not at uh, present at here in the company information. So just delete it. There is a no need. Okay, so I think uh, your visibility is too much low because uh, there is a no tool to zoom it uh, that section. So in the source uh, view, you have to uh, see the all things clearly. In the design view, there is a no uh, options to zoom it. So another uh, you have to take a quantity text box and uh, one button control for the submit and the buy now button you can say. So that thing is the pretty simple you can take it here. Add to cart that button. So uh, thank you very much for watching.